Well, it's a little after uh, 9.30, and right now we are officially in lag time. And this is the first segment for the October 25th, uh, 2013 uh, BTS vlog. Just got to get that timestamp in there. I almost forgot, I always forget the date and timestamp, uh, so I know where to place things. So this is the first segment of uh, the, the October 25th uh, BTS vlog. This BTS vlog is going to be a multi-day BTS vlog. It's not going to be just a single day one. Uh, I'm going to do Friday to uh, basically Monday morning. And uh, sort of put everything together. One of the issues that are that's going on, and this is what was called lag time, is I'm waiting for delivery, and I hate waiting for delivery uh, for equipment. Uh, everything uh, ended up being uh, scheduled for today rather than uh, today and uh, Monday. So uh, when you wait, have to wait for equipment, you there really isn't much to do. You just sort of sit around and, and wait for the delivery to come uh, because there's no one here but me, my, my, but myself. So you have to wait for the delivery guy to come. And then once you get the delivery, when the delivery comes, then you have to sort of start configuring everything. So, because the new equipment has to come into the into the facility, they have it. I have to unpack it, check it out, and make sure that it fits uh, where it needs to go. So that's what we're doing now. We're sitting waiting for delivery, and this is uh, our first segment. Anyways, I'll talk to you in your in in the uh, in a later segment, uh, the next segment which will be sometime after all the stuff is delivered. So when that is, I'm not really too sure. I have a feeling it might be anywhere between 11 a.m. and 1 p.m., but uh, that's a rough, that's, a, that's a kind of a rough estimate. All right, take it easy. For the BTS vlog, uh, another segment of the vlog, this is the second segment. It's about uh, four, quarter past four in the afternoon on uh, October 25th. This is the second segment for uh, the BTS vlog that's going to go from October 25th to 28th. In other words, we're doing Friday to Monday. Uh, we're going to cover the entire weekend with one vlog. Uh, all the shipments came in. All, everything was delivered. Great. Everything seems to be working fine here. I've, uh, I'm actually using the new camera I got in. And I'm, uh, I've already set up the uh, new sound system. Did some fixing up on the computer, so I've got the, the sound system and the piano hooked up to the computer. And um, everything works great, so uh, I'm happy with everything. Now that means uh, the uh, rest of the projects uh, can start moving on. So uh, so that's a good thing for me. <laughs> a very good thing. Um, now it's just a matter of sort of getting myself in order and uh, figuring out what's next. Anyways, uh, I will get back to you in a couple hours, uh, give you some updates on uh, what's been done and give an example of these things. So, uh, play, play, you know, you can hear the piano a little bit uh, as it's hooked up through the computer. Uh, and then uh, talk a little bit more about uh, what's going on for uh, the Cyborg Alpha TV. All right, take it easy. 7.30 in the morning as we uh, bring uh, this BTS vlog to a close. This is the last segment for this BTS vlog. Uh, and it's Monday, October uh, 28th. That's right, October the 28th. <laughs> it's been that, uh, that three-day weekend where everything kind of blurs into one. Everything is kind of blurring into one day anyway, so... Uh, it's the weekend, doing the weekends like this just, just sort of gives me a bit of a break, uh, a chance to catch up, to clear some of the backlog, and sort of, you know, deal with what, what, with with the issues that are going on here that sort of create uh, my backlog. In other words, it allows me to sort of uh, fix things up a little bit more. Um, beyond that, uh, it was... An, uh, well, really an, an, an uneventful weekend. What ended up happening was that as soon as Saturday hit, uh, the fatigue from all the all-nighters, the final crash that I was expecting that, w that would sort of knock me out, 
And the crash what happens when the when you do go finally go into that crash mode, if you've sort of been following for, for following through the week, you'd be watching how it was in the crash mode. But the final crash mode is you end up being asleep more than you are awake and it's very difficult to open your eyes up and uh you're up for maybe two, three hours, and then after two, three hours, uh, you're tired and you need to go back to bed again. And that's sort of what the weekend was like for me. It was sort of like uh, uh, I was in bed most of the weekend, and then only up for two, three hour periods just to eat uh, and stuff like that. And then afterwards, it went right back to bed. And that's where if you're, if you're crash mode, uh, the crash mode process that you sort of set up, I, I refer to it as the crash mode algorithm, where when you get up, if your algorithm is correct and you've got the right efficiency down, then you can actually get work done uh, during those three hour periods. And this really sort of tests your efficiency, do you know how to uh, prioritize what needs to get done when? So that when you're in these sort of cut down periods, you can actually be functional to some degree. And uh, when you come out of the crash mode, which lasts basically 40, for, the crash mode, full crash mode, when you're knocked out completely, it lasts about 48 hours. And then after the 48 hours, you start slowly coming out of it again. And you'll see the rest of the week is going to be, well, it'll be somewhat of a recovery. Not necessarily the rest of the week. Uh, sometimes it takes me a week, sometimes it takes me less than that. It takes me only a couple of days, like Monday and Tuesday, uh, to get out of it. Like two days to get out of it, and, and I'm back to my normal, you know, full load. But, uh, I don't know what's going to be this week, how, how it's going to be this week. Uh, we'll see what, what, what ends up happening. I do have things scheduled for the week. I do have more, uh, actually today I'll be working on... The university some more. That's another product that's sort of uh, now on the page. Uh, I've got more work on, on the uh, Tesla project to do, or should they project Tesla? Uh, I have to work uh, on cleaning. There's a lot of cleaning that has to be done because uh, all the new stuff that came in, the packaging's still all over the place, so that has to be cleaned up. Uh, the uh, electronics workbench has to be worked on. Uh, there's a, there's, a, there's a fair amount of work that has to get done, and I'm planning to bring Insta Vlogs back sometime today or tomorrow. We'll see that later on in the BTS that, the, the, in the BTS that comes uh, for today uh, in a few hours that I'll be talking about Insta Vlogs, and from there we move into uh, uh, somewhat a normal a normalized schedule for filming Beauty and the Geek. So that's what we're going to try again. I've read, worked on the schedule again, looked at things more carefully, and uh, I think I've got a solution to filming uh, the Beauty and the Geek episodes, and that should resolve the problem. I've got a somewhat solution for uh, labeling the episodes, uh, and this will sort of give us a uh, uh, give anyone who's watching an idea of what's actually happening and where we are in uh, the season. So, uh, anyways, uh, we're uh, up for tonight. This is this is sort of it, and I will get back to you. Oh, well, I don't get back. I will see you in a few hours for the beginning of uh, the October twenty fifth, uh, sort of the October twenty eighth uh, BTS vlog. So this is closing uh, the BTS vlog for. October 25th to October 28th. This is one vlog for that. This is, this is the ending segment and the opening segment for the October 28th vlog. BTS vlog is just in a few hours. <laughs> hey, take it easy. Bye-bye.